Hello, hello, welcome back to Nexamon. Uh, it's been a while and I'm having FPS issues, but um, <laughs> hopefully this will be okay. Uh, also, just a little random thing, I realized that, and I don't know if this is really good or bad, I guess, whoops. Uh, it's probably good if you forget, um, but if you exit the game, which I keep going to the wrong menu, um, if you exit the game straight through here without saving, it seems to save anyway. So, just probably something to keep in mind if there's any reason to save scum. I don't know if there is really, but yeah, I just found that odd. Uh, but yes, I guess good and bad. Um, I was just wandering back out this way to see how the FPS was because I don't really know what's going on. It seems to be sitting mostly at 24, but it bumped up out here. Yeah, I'm to 30s, then 50s, but then it dropped back down. In town, it seemed to be the worst, but... It doesn't seem to be going below 24, which I guess is manageable, and hopefully, you know, the uh, 60 FPS recording will make up for it in video, so I think we're okay. So how are we looking is our... So I'm not used to... Uh, I'm using Xbox Elite controller now, which is a lot more comfortable, but I haven't used it in quite a while, so I'm not actually used to it. Alright, we're, uh, right, yeah. Our team was a bit uh, uneven there, but I think we're going to keep going. I um, I don't want to sort of sit around and grind. Basically, as I recall, we're just going after the Dark Lord, like trying to find him or something. Uh, wait, Dark Lord? Is that something right? I'm <laughs> uh, I've been playing Final Fantasy Adventure, getting mixed up here. The Nexo Lord is who I meant to say, and uh, there was Fafnir involved in the last case. Um, Right, yeah, one thing I, I thought about this it was in between this and the last one was it still seems um, further and further weird, especially with what happened in the last one, that we don't go and try and talk to our parents. Like, this whole thing is like, but it just, yeah. I should have actually watched back the last video to get all the smaller details, but uh, no matter. We'll just move forward. I assume there's not going to be anything down in these wells or anything, but I can't help but check. Man, ever since the Nexo Lord named Ivan as Overseer, things have gone downhill. He's just a big bully with an army of bodybuilders, and the only thing they do is work out all day. Someone has to teach him a lesson, but he's actually pretty strong. Oh wait, we've already been through this area. Oh, <laughs> might be getting a tad mixed up. Yeah, I right, we'd walked back here. See, th this is why I should have checked the last episode. It's uh. It's been a lot longer than I intended since getting back to this. So I think we we're good to just move on from here, weren't we? Yeah. Because the gym was up that way. Okay. We're good. Moving on. I will... I'll get back in pace sooner or later. <laughs> Hopefully. Yeah. This looks like, uh... Mostly unknown territory. I don't... Did we go in the house? Well, it doesn't matter. Oh, shit. Getting used to this controller. I don't know, it just feels a bit odd, but it's so much more comfortable. Whoa, is that a Nexamon? Where did you get it from? The coolest Nexamon are in the Eastern Cave, but it's a little dangerous right now because of the rock slides. Okay, doke. Look at this filth. This is why I hate Nexamon. <laughs> my kids are tamers just like you, and they will let those dirty creatures roam around my house all the time. Well, I think that's more a problem with your rules than Nexamon. I mean,. Isn't that just like, like with pets? <laughs> you just sort of deal with that accordingly? Anyway. There have been some really strange earthquakes lately. You know what I think? It must be related to the excavation in the Souls Desert. Uh, Souls Desert. They are digging somewhere, something huge and powerful. Even we can feel it this far away. Okay, this guy's <laughs> working out. I guess, uh, work out when you got the time. And if you're standing on the side of the path, that's... That works. Oh, I thought you were going to be a battle. Go away. That jerk Ivan didn't let me join his gin. He thinks I'm too weak. I'll show him one day. Ah, well, good luck to you. I was hoping I'd get some XP from a battle, but... That's fine. Ah, that stupid cave to the mountains keeps getting blocked by rock slides. It takes us weeks to clear the path, and then boom, another rock slide. I guess we... Did we... I feel like we got something to clear it, or... Hmm, this isn't good. To get to the mountains, we need to enter this cave. 
They say some really awful earthquakes have ha been happening these days. Wait for me. Wait, what? <laughs> okay. Why is Ivan here? You need to get through here to meet the Overseer of the Mountains, am I right? I will lend you a hand. After all, the Great Ivan doesn't work for the Nexa Lord anymore. What are you going to do? Crush the boulders with your bare hands? Yes. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Special destruction technique. Muscle apocalypse. Uh... Oh, I love how it, it just it's just so like it's so anime in such a <laughs> obvious like in your face way with the straightforward names and certain characters with the hair and shit like it it all fits into this but it's like yeah I, I appreciate it <laughs> such a silly way hehe <laughs> and they say my twenty four seven workout routine is a waste of time by the way the cave is ahead. Uh, the cave head is only for experienced tamers. A weakling like you will never survive. You do realize we beat you, right? Shut up. Anyway, you will eventually reach the mountain, the mountain town where you can search for Remus, the overseer. Overseer Remus, huh? Gotcha. I have met the man a few times in the past. I have no doubt that he despises the next lord as much as I do. Thanks. We better hurry now. So what? Like uh, each over overseer is gonna like betray the next lord as we beat them or something? <laughs> Okay, uh, yeah, I don't know if him saying that, like, this is for, uh, not for weaklings and that is meaning, like, we should actually train a little or something, or if he was just saying that, shit-talking. Uh, but either way, we've got a level 10, so we'll be fine. I'm hoping we get an EXP share so that I don't have to actually train each one, like, it'd be, but, well, EXP is good, but there is also, you know, it's nice to not have it at the same time, some more meaning in actually training each one and stuff. I don't know, we'll see how we go as we move along. Anyway, so this is the passage to the mountain town. Yes, it looks to be. I detect multiple hostile Nexpon roaming around, so be careful. Some of them are completely new to you. Be ready to catch them if you want. Now let's hurry and meet Remus to find out what what it is the Nexa Lord is planning. Um, yeah, I think we might actually try and catch a few. That might be good, see if we can get some new guys for the party, but also just catch a few. We sort of skipped over. Ah, oh, God, burps. Perfect thing to do when recording a video. Anyway. Uh, yeah, yeah. Catching some next some Oh, shit. Are these actual random... Okay. Oh, you're right. I wasn't really thinking about because in the, the grassy area, you had those things, but then they shook, but then it's not like ground can shake, so I didn't really think how it would be in other areas. Anyway, right. Our tax. What do we got? I think it's like normal, there's wind and... Is that normal? I feel like it's normal, but it's... I've forgotten their names, because they have like... There's one similar to Pokemon, but then there's others and... Yeah, ah, it's been too long. I should have... Shouldn't have waited. Anyway, let's put this guy to sleep. That's... It's a good move. And... Yeah, wind. Very effective. Oh! Oh right, now I recall right, because it always it shows up in above their health immediately, doesn't it? So as long as I can remember which the pairings are, will be good. And yeah, we'll catch this guy. Oh, we only have seven of those. I think we. Oh yeah, yeah. I recall we spent our money that we had, didn't we? Yeah, it really would have been a good idea for me to check the uh, last video, but <laughs> no, it is what it is now. No, nope. easy. That's. I didn't even read the name, but. What would you like to do? Was it Raffadillo? Um, we'll go storage for now. Don't know how many we'll be catching in here. See if we can get a few more on the way at least. But yeah, so I guess it's full random encounters in this area. What are you doing anyway? <laughs> look, look, look. This place is flooding. We have to get out of here. Now, now, now. Okay. <laughs> I assume they're referring to the drips, but I don't know if that's quite flooding. There's certainly a lot of valuable looking crystals around here. Ooh, we have pincer. Wait. 
That's that's an actual Pokemon name, right? Pinsa? Am I? Am I forgetting? No. Maybe it's slightly different. I'm pretty sure there's a Pokemon named Pinsa. Am I somehow mixing that up? Oh, it's a first gen one too. I should know this. I'm really not sure. Well, either way, we are catching you, Rock Pinsa guy. I don't know how many of those gold ones we'll be getting. I guess I'll save them until just later in the game in general. I can't imagine anything we run into early on will be worth using the 100 cents. I'm curious to know if they are the things, like in mobile, if you can just buy them. That, that was my assumption, though. I'm curious about that. Oh, also, I'd, um, I seen, I mentioned how that there was a sequel, which I still don't know if that's on mobile yet, yet, but I did see it's also coming to Switch, which is quite cool. So if I end up getting through this and enjoying it completely, I will probably get that on Switch. Because it seems like a good title for it. And that's also one more catch. Now let's get past you and see what this shiny thing is. And I assume nothing too crazy and any sleep. Yeah, these are big crystals. Are they just worthless or...? <laughs> Alright, oh. Another random. I definitely prefer it when it's in like, you can tell when they are. I, I, there's a knob, okay. There's definitely some good designs here. Oh shit, almost killed that one. Or knocked out, I should say. Let's get this guy. One again. So I don't really know how uh, these compare to Pokeballs, like in <laughs> going back to Pokemon comparisons again, or uh, like I don't know if it's just these Nexa traps are. Uh, as they are, or if there's going to be other versions between that and the gold, or... But I guess we'll see as we go. Um... Let's add you to party, why not? I don't know how many we can have. I mean, like, we've got... Oop. Oh, I keep... Damn it. I've been playing Nintendo too much. The A and B are swapped around. <laughs> uh, what do we got? Yeah, okay, we were good. Wow. This is <laughs> Yeah, it's gonna it's gonna take me a minute to adjust. This is Ah. <laughs> uh, wow, this is actually Okay, I'm good. I'm good. Don't mind me. Totally normal. Totally normal to be this bad. Uh alright, we can have one more. <laughs> All that for that. Oh shit, okay. Uh Yeah, the <laughs> Yeah, not not ideal this. Thank you. Yeah, I've I've been playing Switch a lot lately, so this has got me all messed up. And um oh shit. I've also been playing Vita a fair bit, but I have a Japanese Vita, so they're swapped on that as well. So oh shit. <laughs> my god, I cannot think and talk and I, I this is like I've I feel like I've gotten better with that, but for some reason next month I feel like there's a lot more to like think about. I guess, so it's, uh, I'm still pretty stumbly, but I'm getting there. Just need to get used to the controller at the same time. Okay, I guess, do they always have the fists above them if they're battling? Maybe that's what it is, I don't recall. I wonder how big the, uh, main campaign of this actually is. So we'll get some XP. Although, the health is getting down a bit. I don't know what, uh, supplies we have. Probably check on that. Oh, did they? It looked like one of the others just got experience. I thought we'd confirm the fact that that doesn't happen. Apparently, I'm mistaken. And yes, I just used the wrong button again. <laughs> God, I used to be so much better at changing between. It was easier when I was a kid. <laughs> what is a kid doing in a place like this? Well, traveling. You think a you think you're tough enough to venture around here? Did you've been challenged to a Nexamon battle? Okay, he's got all the gems. I guess they're valuable to someone. Oh, that's cool looking. Jemine, Jemine, Jemine. Yep, something like that. Sleep, pretty much going to be the go-to, I think. And good thing we used a potion. Hmm. Yeah, try one more sleep. Good, 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 good. 
Yeah, I don't know why, just I, I really have felt like I've got better with sort of the talking and doing and stuff, but with this it's like, I don't know, because I'm discovering new things, which is sort of interesting, and I'm looking at them, but also I need to sort of actually think about the battle, even though it's not that uh, difficult, and uh, I don't know, <laughs> lots of little things, so I'm, I'm certainly more stumbly than I have been, but I'll get there. Okay, there's a weird magnum. Interesting. I'm, I'm really liking a lot of these designs. Like, yeah, there's, yeah, I really don't have anything bad to say about them. I'm curious how many new ones there are in the sequel. That was probably, yeah, being electric, that's probably not the best attack to be using. Because, I mean, I'm, I'm talking here, but now I'm not actually thinking about what I'm actually using. Uh, I don't know how wind goes against this. Uh, maybe? Yeah, no, not effective. That doesn't surprise me. I may have to use a potion and swap. Uh, oh shit, can I not use... Why can I not use anything? Oh! That shit, skills, ST1 slash 100. I don't think I even... Yeah, it was, yeah, I was not paying attention to that at all last time, I don't think. So, can you not do anything when that hits? Oh, resting. Alright, does that put it back up? Oh, alright. That's interesting. Let's try and put to sleep and then... Alright, that didn't go so well. They could change over to... Knob. Oh, seven health. No, that was not a good idea. Oh, okay. And then we will potion, and then hopefully win from there. Uh, it may actually be worth me stopping for a minute to level a couple of things up. Oh shit. Really? <laughs> I thought, why wasn't the potion used? Okay. I, I don't know if I just, hmm, I don't know. My mistake, or the order was unexpected there? Um, no, we'll just go with whatever's the strongest, and if none of them are great. It still does enough damage. <laughs> Quite the battle considering it's half my level, I uh... Yeah. Not, not, not a good performance by me there. Oh shit, right, they have more, don't they? Although this one's wind, which is definitely better. Except for me not having any of that shit, so... Can I potion? I mean, if I can't move, or does that not give me rest, then? Oh, I specifically, uh, okay, I specifically need to actually rest, okay. I really hadn't noticed that one since 100 things, so I guess maybe, uh, I don't know, I assume you can get potions restored, or do you just have to actually go to the healing centers for that? Well, I guess we'll find out anyway. <laughs> Might have to turn around and get a heal before moving forward. What did that, that was agility up or something? I'm not too sure. Oh, that is this trainer down. Okay, yeah, so... Fe uh, Feathera, Baron, and Alpoka definitely seem to go up then. I, I don't know, is it... But they're in level 3 and they didn't go up much. So maybe it actually is that your party members do get uh, XP, but it's just... it It's only a fraction compared to the main one, and so it's nowhere near as noticeable. That... Sort of would fit what I just saw, I think. Okay, feather, feather went up a level, that's good. Yeah, I'm not sure, I'll just have to observe as the battles go on. Well, well, it seems kids these days do know what they are doing after all. Go on, friend, the next one of this cave are no match against you. <laughs> Thank you, I seem like I'm actually through most of the cave. All right, that's, yeah, oh shit. Damn A button. <laughs> all right, we'll continue on because this guy doesn't seem to want to battle anyway. If the punching gloves indicate it. One, two, three. Hmm? You claim defeated Master Ivan? Ha ha ha, please kid, go back to town now. Well, I got through the cave, that's got, that's, that should be some indication of that. Another knob. <laughs> Good name there. I wonder what that uh, knob evolves into. It looks like it could be something cool. It's got a um, very slashy type of vibe going to it. 
Oh, should have should have watched more on the XP there. It'd be good if you actually see the numbers there. Although I guess I could just check the actual numbers. Um, oh, okay. I was thinking this might have been the end of the cave because. Well, I don't know why, I was just thinking it might be. <laughs> uh, that's why I wasn't going to turn around, but I wouldn't mind actually having Nob healed. Wow, this side is amazing. Did you see, did you know that this place used to be hundreds of levels deep? According to legend, an ancient Nexamon flooded this whole place to stop people from digging. Well, that's one way to go about it. Hey, relax, it's just a myth. There's no such thing as huge evil in ancient Nexamon, I think. Well, if there is, we have golden nexa traps, so game over. <laughs> Maybe. I think. Okay, do we have any revival items? I don't think so. Oh, we, we have one revive, which... Hmm, is that worth using? Probably... We got some cash. Yeah, you know what? I think, uh... Let's, let's just do a quick trip back. Ooh, we have another new encounter. Can, can drama. Okay. Definitely, uh... I, wait, is there a... Yeah, I can't think of there's a candle Pokemon. I know that there's a Pokemon that has a candle. I'm not sure if there's an actual candle Pokemon, though. Hmm. Either way, I like it. So this will be another catch. Not very effective on flame. That, that makes sense. I should probably have used something else. Uh, normal attack's probably fine. Oh shit, almost down. Should be an easy catch though, so that is good. Down to four of those. We might want to grab a couple of those depending on if we can buy revives, what they cost and stuff. We don't have too much cash. And that's one more. I think we might actually keep Candrama in our party too. Might have a cool evolution. I really don't know how many of them actually evolve, like, so that'll be interesting to see. Alright, onward to town. Oh, I think, oh shit, controller not working. Oh yeah, uh, I think we've encountered one of these, but we haven't caught one, so may as well try and get another one. I'm only a few steps later, but getting more next one certainly doesn't hurt. Other than might run out of next traps, but well, it's no matter, it's only a cave. I'll be going back through it, and I should probably watch my health. You know, let's just go with that. Oh yeah, I, I keep reading that part at the bottom, and I get confused because it feels like it's um, this hyper message you'd get when you hover over it or something. Uh, though I do realize, in saying that, the fact that that message does appear at the bottom, static like that, and with the way they two appear, probably means there aren't any other types of Nexima, Nexa traps. It could be, but that does seem to suggest it to me at least. And I just captured a night tight. Is that what it was? I didn't really pay attention much. Night tight. Night tight. Night tight. Right, you can go to storage, eh? You just remind me of Zubat because you're a bat, so. I mean, you look cooler, but, you know, bats make me think of Zubat and. Oh, fuck me. God, so, so many of them. So many of them in my childhood. I really, really hope the sequel added running shoes. It's 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 pretty damn slow. I, I hope this fast travel later. <laughs> All right, let's see what we can get. Hello, my friend. You need anything for your adventure? I think I do. Right, so we got two of them left. Uh, what are the prices we're looking at here? Oh wow, you can actually get quite a lot of stuff. Oh shit. Okay, they're fine for now. Let's get two of those. Oh, ethers restore stamina, right. Okay, that makes sense, so, okay. We have plenty of them, so if that comes up, we're good for out of battle. Um, don't need that, right, right, yep. Moving on, what else? Uh, Paralyzed, we've got three of them, a couple of them. Don't really care about confusion. Um, revives, they're pretty expensive considering how much we have. I'm tempted, we've got one, but yeah, on, I think for now, whoops. And there we go again with the bad keys. Well, 
bad keys, me pressing the wrong buttons would be a more accurate way to put that. Uh, right, next to traps is what I was meaning to get. Yeah, I think we'll grab like six of those and that'll do. I don't really think it's worth anything else. But we can catch a few more, so that's good. Oh, I, uh, I also rearranged the party, not that that really has any real impact on anything, but this will be our order at least. I definitely want to evolve uh, Kandorama. Hobbin as well. Baron, I'm also curious about evolution. No, I'm curious, but less so. Alpoka, nah, maybe. I like the look, but I don't know if it'll be that useful. Although, at the moment, we don't have any... Oh no, yeah, right, they're both wind. Thought we're all uh, different types, but close. But Hobbin looks cool, so... I mean, it's a bird with a hat, which... And it's got, like, the the eye things. I don't know what the hell you call that. Either way, it's great, so... Yeah, Hobbin, Hobbin's sticking around for now. And I don't think there's anything else to do here. Could take a quick look out here for any other Nexamon to catch. So, I didn't have any luck catching any more um, Nexamon there, but... Something that strange did happen was it hit 60 FPS and it like sped up and it made me realize it's been sitting 24 like I mentioned and I think that that's been like heavily tied to the movement speed. So I think the character would actually be running a lot faster if this was sitting at a solid 60 FPS. So I'm going to have to see what I can do between this and the next episode but I, I don't know why it's low. Like, I can open up another game right now, uh, which I did before this, I didn't know what was going on, to see if it was just my computer being weird, but no, it was just fine, so... I really don't know why the FPS is so low on this. Um, I don't know, it could be a common issue, I don't know, I'll have to just look up, but... If I can get it to a smooth 60, it may mean running around. Ooh, just there. I don't know if you could... I assume you could probably tell the difference there, but... 60 FPS will smooth out the movement anyway, so... Uh, but if you can see there, I sped up for a second, which is... Yeah, that, that, I hadn't had that happen before, but... It happened a couple times there, so... I don't know. But, uh... Anyway, just, uh... I'm gonna get through this and get back to where we were. Alright, we're back here. And yeah, it definitely does seem like they all get XP. Uh, in XP share style, so I don't know why I seem to confirm otherwise. Maybe they were just, like, such... They were so low, or they didn't really... I don't know, like, if it's fractional, they were just so low, it didn't do enough, or... Uh, I really don't know. Either way, they definitely do all seem to be going up, so... That's good. Um, it'd be good to confirm exactly how it works, just for reference, but... You know, it's good. Ooh, Digger, interesting. That's that's a cool one. That, yeah, I might go to the party with that guy. That looks also like it could have a very interesting... Um, evolution. And it just went 60 FPS again for a second. Holy shit, it looks smooth. This is definitely, yeah. I definitely need to do something about that. It's, oh, it looks so much better when it goes smooth there. Uh, I wonder why it's so low. It's so strange. Oh shit. Wasn't really thinking there, I wanted to capture. No matter. Oh yeah, it seemed to give a good amount of experience. And uh, it definitely seems like you can farm cash just from killing mobs. I didn't realize how much was getting. Uh, mobs. I <laughs> Nexamon. So farming could be a good thing if we need to get some Nexa traps or just potions or any of that shit. Um, what else was I going to say? I don't know. So no matter. We will move on and we will battle this person, but I want to grab this first. Oh shit. Another one? Nope. We have a bat. Don't. Oh no, that's alright. Oh yeah, they're both wind. I was the bat was something else for something there. Um. Oh, we got another level. Nice. Yeah, I don't know if... Whoops. Still going there. Although, actually, I do want to use one of them. On Kandorama. I would like to level him up. No, I forgot what I was going to say before. I was, <laughs> I was trying to get back to it, but no. Let's, let's go for this battle. Hello, yes, I want to battle. What? The rock side is clear now? Thank goodness, I've been trapped in here for days. I caught a bunch of amazing Nexamon. Take a look. You've been trapped in here for days, you find there's a way out, and the first thing you want to do is battle. 
Alrighty. You do you. Oh, okay. It's an in what is that? Wee Bride. Alright. Let's go with sleep. Damn it. Let's try s oh, touche. Lullaby and back at me. I was planning to sleep and switch, but I guess we'll just go with the switch. Oh, wind type. I was immediately looking at the in bug, which is why I swapped, but uh we also have lullaby on this. So let's go with flame just in case. Very effective still. I don't know if they can be two types in Nexamon, because that could definitely be winded bug, if anything, but I don't know if it works that way. Hopefully uh, Kendrama can survive and get some XP though, that'd be nice. Oh, damn, we may not survive the next hit. Just, very lucky. Oh, the poison though. Yep, no, all good. Oh, the poison may still knock him out. No? Yes, probably. Damn. I was thinking, yeah, I was forgetting about the others, of course they exist. Damn, that sucks. I really want Kandoram to get XP. Alright. Oh, right, you're sleeping, aren't you? Now, we do have a revive, but... Er, I'm hesitant to use it, um... Because I wouldn't mind using it just for Kandoram to get the XP, but... I'm probably better to wait until the last, uh the last one, just in case I need to use it on Feather. And... Yeah, that, that, one, that one's better. Damn it! come on, wake up! <laughs> well, at least he wasted a move that time. And there we go. Yeah, it seems like Wind can do a lot of damage against those guys. I don't know if they're ground or earth or... I forget what the term is for this. There's one more down though. This guy, all, is it going to be all ground? Oh no, we have a Cheek Monk. Alright. Still, I continue to really like a lot of these designs. Damn it. It doesn't have a great success rate. Uh, on some, yeah, probably on... Yeah, for these battles, it's probably better off not using that. Uh, let's just go with a normal attack. Should be close enough to get him down in another 2, 1 if I'm lucky. Oh yeah, there we go. And now I... Oh, we got water. I might use a potion on Feathera. Well, actually... No, it's unlikely the next attack will kill me. I'm going to do a revive. I don't know if it's really worth the XP to spend a revive. But I want Kendrama alive anyway after the battle, so... I guess, I guess it's fine. Uh... How does wind go against water? Probably normal? Yeah, that's good. Slowly learning, slowly learning. Go one more wind pellet and we're good. Let's hope Ken oh yeah, Kendrama got a level up. That uh that makes it more worth it. Even if he was really close, it just makes it seem like it was worth it, so that's something. Well of course I lost. I haven't had the chance to train my new Nexamon. Well why did you paddle me? I didn't even grab this thing that I mentioned. <laughs> okay, it's just an ether. Ether. Hello. This was my first expedition into the caves, and then there was a rock slide. I've been stuck in this horrible place for days. Is it true the way is open again? Yes, so you can go. Run. It's just, just jump across the water. Or more safely go around, but either way, you're good. I wonder how big this area is. I'm assuming not too much more. Although, we still have a bit more to go here, it seems. Alright. It's interesting how like there's a lot of uh, non-trainers in here. Or well, I guess it's not interesting. I'm just I'm so used to the like in Pokemon, you'd rarely ever see someone in a cave who wasn't ready to battle you. Oh hey there, friend. I'm trying to snap some good pictures around the world, you know. These pics will be a good reference for a video game I'm working on. All right. Good luck to you. You found a Nexa trap. All right, that's 250. Uh, I don't know what the currency in this game is called actually. We have a pincer, which we have already captured, and we are just going to level. There we go. <laughs> Too easy. And Feather is quite down on health. Ooh, new skill, Choke. Bind your opponent on the spot with his powerful physical attack. Awesome. And Featherer definitely deserves a potion. Oh, or not, because you... Oh, 
Health restores on level up. Didn't recall that. Also good. Also good. And is this the exit? Don't. Maybe. Looks like it. Oh no. No. Still going. All right. Yeah, I quite like this cave. I mean, it's it's simple style, but it's um, a lot of the art in this I like. I mean, because it's a dark cave, but it's very very bright. I, and I I just prefer it like that. I like to be able to see everything, and yeah, it's good. I assume probably not too much more to it though. Oh, okay. Fuck. Hello. Didn't expect to face a Featherer. Interesting. So I guess the starter Pokemon... Uh, <laughs> starter Nexamon aren't too significant in this? Although I guess with the latest Pokemon games, they sort of made other starters just roam in the wild, so... Oh wait, uh, let, let's go, I mean. But... Hmm. I don't know. No matter. Ooh, the mountain village, you say? Yes, yes, you're nearly there, buddy. Our village is ruled by Remus, the overseer. Big guy, you'll love to meet him. Yeah, so I wonder if that means we can actually find all of the other starters in the wild, too. I can't even remember what they all look like, but uh, it'd be good to get them. I recall liking some of them. Because <laughs> it was quite a... Was there six or... I think it was six. Might have been eight. Six? Hmm, one of them. Uh, yeah, anyway. Kill knob. Or knock out. Must be just like leaving a trail of all these knocked out Nexamon, like... It's uh... It doesn't really seem like a good thing, I mean really, you go through the... Same with like in Pokemon. By the end of a cave, there must be... There's just gonna be like these scattered bodies all over the place, all knocked out, I mean... And especially in like Pokemon, Team Rocket come in and literally just start fucking scooping up the Pokemon that you knock out. I never really thought about that. <laughs> I mean that applies outside too, I mean... How many times have people were just walked by after you've been training and there is just fucking bodies littering the ground? And they're not dead, but holy shit, you know? What kind of a sight would that be for your average person just in the Pokemon world? Anyway, just a thought I had. Wow, we did it. Yes, we did. That was exhausting, but hey, the mountain town should be near mine. Just a little bit more. Wait, how is wheelchair girl going to get here? I mean, she seems pretty awesome, but goddamn, getting through that shit with your wheelchair. That'd be a tough one. Just watch your step, okay? Or is she waiting for us? I don't remember where she ended up. I know she split off from us, but I don't remember what to do. Hmm. Shit, what does it say? East Mountain Village. Yes, yes it is. Alrighty. If your next one runs out of stomach, you won't be able to form any skills. Try to buy some ethers to keep that from happening. Yeah, you would have been a good NPC to have at the beginning. I didn't quite figure that one out immediately. <laughs> um, all right, let. I don't want to do this battle yet. I want to. Is if the eastern. Uh, I mean, if the mountain village to the east is right here, then it'd be good to heal up and everything first. But if there's another area, we'll step back. So what do we got? Village or area? We got an area. <laughs> all right. What are we looking on for time? It's actually, oh yeah, this is actually getting on a bit more than I realized, so I might actually stop here now that we're out of the cave. Um, I mean, the, you know, the cave is something, I'll call that a making progress, because uh, I don't want to get this too long. So yeah, I, I think we'll actually stop here. We can finish up here and get to the next town. Hopefully, we'll beat the Overseer in that. I think that would make good for the next one. Um, yeah, so, yeah, all right. Um, I thank you very much for watching as always. I really do appreciate it. I know that this was being quite a stumbly one getting back into it, but I feel like I am actually slowly getting back into it. I'm going to try and play this some more of this tonight or tomorrow because I want to properly actually get back into it and be able to think and battle and talk and do all the stuff at once that I've been having some trouble with. But um, I, I am having fun with it either way. So if you can get through the stumbles, as I said, I really do appreciate it. And um, yeah. Okay, I uh, didn't expect to be having this update so quick, but holy fuck, I just had to add it. I I assume you're going to be able to tell the difference quite a lot. Look at look at my speed now. This is this is crazy. This this is 144 FPS, steady 144 FPS compared to what I've been playing at what was 24 sta stable, bumping up a bit here and there. Ah, oh, I cannot believe how much better it is. Look, look at how much smoother the animations are. Holy shit, I have been having a subpar experience without realizing just how subpar it was. 
Um, yeah, I, I'm actually seeing, I think, I don't even know if it should be 144. I'm, it might be better locking it to 60. Uh, I'm noticing a bit of blur with him moving at full speed at 144, although either way, it looks great and it's so much better. So that, that is resolved and I just wanted to update and this all came from simply turning off my secondary monitor. I mean, I, I, I can't believe how much difference it made. Like, I obviously know it's going to impact something, but it seems like it was just messing up completely like because everything else on my computer is shut down when i'm recording other than the game and obs the second monitor is on just so that i can monitor obs and make sure things are looking as they should be but yet that was enough to cause this to be down like that and i i don't know why though i've i do all sorts of stuff with that on just without problem normally uh but yeah quick quick resolve so that's that's gonna be good um yeah, just felt like updating, because, you know, why not? <laughs> Alright, uh, thank you very much again for watching, I appreciate it, have a good one, bye for now.